Welcome Cobra Kai fans, in this episode we will talk about what will happen in season 6 for a Johnny Lawrence happy ending. Johnny has transformed from a desperate and lonely man living in the past to a mature adult who has finally found happiness and now has a family of his own. With a baby on the way, season 6 should feature the wedding of Johnny and Carmen. This would be the perfect ending for Johnny, as it would bring his character full circle from where he started and the best way to end the series. Now let's look at a few scenarios. Miguel and Robbie will officially be stepbrothers. Thanks to Johnny's technique, the both of them seem to have buried the hatchet and are now on good terms, so all is good. The best part of Johnny and Carmen's wedding will of course be the guests in attendance. This is where I'm predicting where you will see many of the Karate Kid legacy characters return. You will obviously have the OG Cobras such as Bobby Brown who is now a pastor and will more than likely have the privilege of marrying the two at the reception. Jimmy will for sure be there and yes this is where I hope and expect to see Dutch make his return. A nice small cameo for Chad McQueen would be icing on the cake. You will obviously see the entire LaRusso family there. I can't wait to see cousin Louis LaRusso throw it down at the wedding party. We know he knows how to throw a party. The lovely Allie Mills will also be there. I wonder if she will bring a date now that she's a free agent. Time will tell. And I also do expect Daryl Vidal to be in attendance. Johnny and Vidal have a deep history fighting one another at the All Valley tournaments. Daryl Vidal defeated Johnny in the quarterfinals in 1981 and became champion that year then lost to Johnny in the semis in 1984, so I'm sure the two have a lot of mutual respect for one another. You will also see Chosen there, and we also found out that he has feelings for Kumiko. I would like to see you when I come home, Kumiko. We like that very much. Yo, I can see the both of them there as well. Of course, we will also see a bunch of the students present, as well as such as Hawk, Dimitri, the list goes on. Now, as for Mike Barnes, they did just meet, so we have to see how that pans out in season six, because I do think Mike Barnes is very unpredictable and could have other things on his mind. And depending on what the creators do with his character as well, you may want to check out my theories on that. John Kreese will be tricky to predict as there is so many theories about him possibly dying in the last and final season. So I would say both Barnes and Kreese are 50-50 as of now just to be on the safe side. Now here's a question for all of you. Do you think Johnny and Carmen will have a boy or a girl? Well, if you want to know my prediction, I say a girl. Why you ask? Well. Obviously his biological son is Robbie and now his future steps on Miguel are males, right? So now as Mr. Miyagi would say Have a balance. Now here are the possible names. Yeah. Alright, Brandy, Heather, Channing, Brianna, Amber, Sabrina, Melody, Dakota, Sierra, Bambi, Crystal, Samantha, Autumn, Ruby, Taylor, Tara, Tammy, Lauren, Charlene, Chantel, Courtney, Misty, Jenny, Krista, Mindy, Noel, Shelby, Trina, Reba, Cassandra, Nikki, Kelsey, Shauna, Jolene, Erling, Claudine, Savannah, Casey, Dolly, Kendra, Kali, Chloe, Devin, Emily, Luke, Becky! Nope. <laughs> now before I end this episode, I save the best part for last. Who will be Johnny's best man at his wedding? You got it. None other than Daniel LaRusso. Their relationship has gotten stronger and closer throughout the last few seasons, so I just don't see anyone else filling that role. The two have more in common than they thought, and it showed in each and every episode, so this would be a nice way to end the series, and I'm sure it would be an honor for Daniel LaRusso as well. That is it for this episode. Don't forget to comment down below and hit that subscribe button. Until next time, thanks for watching.